you can tell uh, if someone else is colorblind by the clothes they're wearing. Do they match? Do the socks match? The most common type of colorblindness is people who can't distinguish between red and green. They both look sort of brown. If they look at a stoplight, for instance, they know which is stop and which is go because of the position of the light as opposed to the color. Color blindness is very common. It is common among men, but not among women. Color blindness is something, though, that many people don't realize that they have unless they're formally tested. That sort of formal testing is looking at a series of images or plates that have dots of different colors, and those dots will form numbers, and someone who's colorblind won't be able to see some of them. There may be a crooked pathway that those dots are making, and someone who has a certain type of colorblindness may not be able to see that pathway. So there are tests that we can do that will tell us not only whether or not somebody's colorblind, but what kind of colorblindness a person has. There actually are several different types of, uh, of colorblindness, but the most common is uh, red-green colorblind. Typically, this is something you are born with. There are some diseases where you'll lose the ability to perceive color, but in general, for the most common types of colorblindness, um, we're talking about something that you're born with.